Let's write the balanced net ionic equation for SrNO3 2 plus KiO3. We have strontium nitrate here. This is potassium iodate. So the first thing we do with net ionic equations, we balance the molecular equation. This is the molecular equation here. I can see that I have a nitrate here. I have two of them here and only one nitrate ion there. Put a two here, it balances the nitrates. Let's put a two here to balance the potassium atoms. And that looks like it does it. This is the balanced molecular equation. Next, we want to write the state for each substance. And that'll look like this. So nitrates, they're going to be soluble. And then compounds with potassium, they're soluble as well, usually. Strontium iodate is slightly soluble. Just a little bit of it dissolves. So we're going to call this a solid in our net ionic equation. So now we can split the strong electrolytes part into ions. This is going to be the complete ionic equation. Strontium iodate, we said that's slightly soluble, so we're going to call that a solid. We don't split solids apart in net ionic equations. So the complete ionic equation, that's going to look like this. So now we can cross out spectator ions. They're on both sides of the complete ionic equation. So on the top we have reactants, down here we have our products. In the reactants here we have these two nitrate ions. We also have those in the products. These are spectator ions, we cross those out. We have two potassium ions, reactants, two potassium ions, products. Spectator ions, cross them out. And what's left, that's the net ionic equation for strontium nitrate plus potassium iodate. I'll clean this up, write the states, we'll have our net ionic equation. So this is the balanced net ionic equation for SrNO3 2 plus KiO3. You'll note that charge is balanced. We have two plus here and then two times one minus, that's two minus. So that's all over here. This is a net charge of zero. Products, neutral, so net charge of zero. Count the atoms up, they're balanced as well. Note that this solid strontium iodate, when these two substances react, this will be the precipitate. It'll fall to the bottom of the test tube in this double displacement reaction. This is Dr. B with the net ionic equation for strontium nitrate plus potassium iodate. Thanks for watching.